Step into a world where time travel isn't just a concept, but a gripping adventure. The Time Tunnel, a 1966 TV series, takes you on a thrilling journey with two scientists lost in the corridors of time. As they navigate through different historical events, each episode unfolds with a mix of funny, shocking, and sometimes even heart-wrenching moments. With a diverse array of roles, the characters bring history to life. Have you found a favorite among them? Share your thoughts below. But that's not all stick around because we've got plenty of surprising facts about the series coming your way. Do you have a cherished memory linked to this timeless show? Perhaps a moment that still brings a smile to your face or a scene that left a lasting impression? We'd love to hear your stories and memories in the comments below. Get ready for an exploration of laughter, shock, and nostalgia. Keep watching as we unravel the fascinating layers of the time tunnel and share your own experiences. Your journey through time is about to become even more captivating. Share your thoughts and memories below. We can't wait to hear from you. The Time Tunnel, an unforgettable trip through time. The Time Tunnel, a television series from 1966, evokes a sense of intrigue for viewers exploring the concept of time travel. Much like the original Star Trek series, it presents a captivating premise. One could imagine the episodes as lost counterparts to the iconic Star Trek, potentially improving upon certain plot lines. The experience of watching it began for many around the time of the World Trade Towers attack in 2001. During this sensitive period, certain episodes faced scrutiny for their thematic relevance. An episode depicting the events of Pearl Harbor during the Japanese attack, titled The Day the Sky Fell Down, was deemed unsuitable for immediate airing after 9-11. However, a scheduling error led to the removal of a different episode, The Last Patrol, with the second episode being aired again. Eventually, The Day the Sky Fell Down was broadcast on Thursday, September 13, 2001. Despite its intriguing premise, the show fell short of its potential. It introduced a device capable of sending characters to any time and space, promising endless story possibilities. However, as it progressed, it deviated into familiar, low-budget plot lines involving silver-suited aliens. This departure from the initial potential was disappointing. Comparisons with Star Trek highlight a significant difference in producer approach. While Star Trek, despite its budget constraints, addressed social issues through science fiction narratives, the time tunnel, under Irwin Allen's production, leaned more towards flashy explosions, impressive spaceships, and captivating monster suits. The absence of a visionary like Gene Roddenberry, who focused on social commentary, is seen as a missed opportunity for it to achieve greater storytelling heights. In conclusion, the show had a promising premise but failed to live up to its potential. The shift from exploring diverse historical events to repetitive alien encounters diminished its appeal. The contrast in producer priorities between Irwin Allen and Gene Roddenberry is evident in the missed opportunities for richer storytelling. Overall, it could have been a more captivating exploration of time travel and historical events. In 1966 and 1967, viewers were transported through the time tunnel to different eras, courtesy of the fictional project TikTok unfolding in 1968. The show delved into the past in episodes like Crack of Doom set in 1883 and Raiders from Outer Space. Meanwhile, futuristic narratives unfolded in 1978 with One Way to the Moon and Town of Terror. Amid the cancellation of renowned series like The Twilight Zone and The Outer Limits, 1966 marked a surge in sci-fi fantasy on television. The Time Tunnel joined the ranks alongside Star Trek, Batman, The Green Hornet, Ultraman, It's About Time, and Space Ghost. Despite its promising premise, the show faced cancellation after one season, leaving protagonists forever displaced in time. In a DVD interview, Robert Colbert revealed that had the series continued, the plan was to finally bring them home. The proposed direction echoed the concept of fixing historical anomalies akin to the later series Quantum Leap. The year 1966 witnessed a sci-fi renaissance on television, with the series emerging as a significant player. The cancellation, however, deprived fans of a resolution for the characters' temporal plight. The missed opportunity to explore their journey home leaves fans contemplating the untapped potential of the show. The proposed continuation, had it materialized, could have offered a unique twist on time travel narratives. In retrospect, the time tunnel shares its place in television history with other genre-defining shows of 1966. 
The TV movie remains a testament to the era's fascination with speculative storytelling, even as its own journey through time came to an untimely end. The allure of what could have been lingers, leaving fans to ponder the unresolved fate of the characters. The Time Tunnel, a television series renowned for its exploration of time travel, left an indelible mark on viewers with its unique narrative structure. Each episode concluded with a cliffhanger, creating anticipation for the next installment. Notably, the final episode seamlessly connected with the series' debut, maintaining a continuous loop of suspense. Before its television premiere, the Time Tunnel was preview wood for eager fans at the 1966 World Science Fiction Convention in Cleveland. This strategic move generated early buzz and heightened anticipation for the show's debut. The program's impact extended beyond its gripping storyline. Due to overlapping eligibility requirements for the 1967 and 1968 Emmy Awards, the Time Tunnel received nominations in two separate ceremonies. This recognition underscored its significance in the television landscape during that period. The show's thematic diversity was evident in episodes like Crack of Doom, set in 1983, and Raiders from Outer Space, exploring futuristic narratives in 1978. As the series unfolded in the midst of a sci-fi renaissance in 1966, it joined the ranks of other genre-defining shows, including Star Trek and Batman. Despite its promising premise, the time tunnel faced an untimely cancellation after one season, leaving protagonists stranded in various eras. In a revealing DVD interview, actor Robert Colbert shared that had the series continued, the plan was to bring the characters back home, akin to the later series Quantum Leap. The cancellation marked a missed opportunity for fans who were left pondering the unresolved fate of the characters and the untapped potential of the show. In retrospect, the time tunnel stands as a testament to the speculative storytelling fascination of the era, with its journey through time leaving a lasting impression on television history. Whit Bissell, recognized for his role in the Time Tunnel, was part of two adaptations of H.G. Wells' novel that popularized Time Machines, The Time Machine, and The Time Machine. This connection adds an interesting layer to his involvement in the series, showcasing his familiarity with the theme of time travel. The opening and closing theme music of the show was composed by John Williams under the pseudonym Johnny Williams. This behind-the-scenes detail sheds light on the talent involved in creating the atmospheric soundscape, contributing to its overall appeal. John Zermba, another face from the Time Tunnel, had previously appeared in the Twilight Zone episode titled No Time Like the Past. In that episode, the main character is a scientist who also experiences time travel, offering a parallel to the themes explored in the series. This connection with other time travel narratives in Zermba's career adds depth to his contribution to the genre. These interconnections with other time travel related works and talents bring a unique perspective to the show, showcasing its place in the broader context of science fiction television during the 1960s. The series, while having its own distinct narrative, benefits from the experiences and expertise of its cast and crew members in the realm of time travel storytelling.